So I want to echo my colleagues' comments. Madam Rajavi, we're so proud to know you and to see you and to be able to support you. What you're doing is vital. We in Texas understand a fight for liberty like few others do. I do want to say something about our friend from Tennessee, Steve Cohen. I was uh, mildly surprised and glad to hear him say he's going to live forever. <laughs> Because I look in the mirror every morning and I think, gosh, if I'd known I was going to live this long, I'd have taken better care of myself. <laughs> so I can only imagine how he feels. This is important. Um, and, any, and Danny Davis said it great. Any government who would harm children doesn't deserve to be in power. Uh, we watch the things that are going on, the poisoning of schoolgirls, the use of shotguns to blind students. It breaks my heart. I can't tell you all how important it is that y'all are here to support that Madam Rajavi, your continued diligence, the willingness, the faithfulness to put yourself basically in, out there and in harm's way because you have to know that if the tyrants could find you, you, they would make short work of you and that goes for anybody who disagrees with them. Thomas Jefferson once said that the tree of liberty is often refreshed by the blood of tyrants and of patriots. And that was in their fight for United States independence from Britain. Well, Madam Mojave has taken it upon herself to represent the fight for freedom and liberty, not just for the girls and the women, which is extremely important for all Iranians. I can't tell you how, how much we admire her, how much we love what she's doing, the support y'all are giving her. Uh, Americans need to hear no more about this, as my colleague Lance Gooden said, and they would be behind Iran. Iran is what, what I would say Ronald Reagan said back, referring to Russia, the evil empire. Now, they do not deserve to be in power. God will surely judge them, and our, our prayer is quickly, too, that they will take down those tyrants, that he will take down those tyrants, and Iranians will once again be free. Thank you all very much, and I yield back.